is officially fall and I am um, so excited about it. I am headed out to run a couple of errands. Um, I'm going to get some stuff for dinner and I'm going to run into Home Goods to look at some things because uh, my mom was asking about decorating their house um, with the little fall decorations and stuff. So I'm going to go over to Home Goods and see what I can see over there. I might run into Michaels because a friend of hers told her that Michaels had a really good sale going on right now. So I'll probably run by those two stores. Um, and definitely going to go to the grocery store to pick up some things to go with dinner. Um, I'm making a lasagna. Lasagna. Um, and going to do some chicken breast, yams, and green beans. <clears throat> Probably going to fry some cabbage also. And I'm trying to think what else I'm going to fix to go with it. I feel like I need a another starch because the yams never last us a whole good long while a whole good long while what they never last us you know more than like two days i need something that's gonna be for a few days so um thinking about another starch that i could make to go with the um chicken and green beans I could do like mashed potatoes. No, I don't. Mm -mm. Well, no, that actually would work. Mashed potatoes, green beans, and the chicken. That would actually, that could work. Um, so yeah, welcome to a, I don't know if this is gonna be a daily vlog or a weekly vlog. We shall see. Um, but I might do a little bit of cooking with me today. And what else? Mm, I think that's gonna be it. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today. These errands and um, cooking, that's all I got going on. It's kind of gloomy, like the sun was popping up a little bit, but it's actually kind of gloomy today because it drizzled and then I think it rained last night. Um, so instead of me just throwing on something, I put on just a little bit of color to brighten up my mood so I think I showed you did I show y'all that already yeah no I didn't so outfit of the day is just this adulting makes me wine t-shirt my um tiered layer necklace from tiktok shop my bracelets from tiktok shop my bangles from tiktok shop I don't even know where I got these earrings from, but I have had them. Child, I had these earrings probably about 15 years at least. Yo! That was scary. Um, yeah, at least 15 years. I don't know. I probably bought them from some jewelry vendor at an event somewhere. Got on my red, um, they're kind of like, they're not linen. They're like, um, they remind me when I, once I put them on, they're my red pants from TikTok, uh, TikTok shop. But once I put them on, they actually feel more like, <sighs> y'all know the um, streamer that you hang up for parties? That's what it reminds me of. Like, not the texture, so I shouldn't say they feel like it, but the way that they look, the texture is like, I mean, not the texture. The texture, the way it looks, it looks like that crinkly paper that you use for birthday parties, like to hang for streamers and make bows and such. But I like the way they fit on me. They are really loose. Um, only thing is, they are kind of thin. They, you can see through them, so you need to wear some undergarments. Um, but they're cool. They are very long, so they are extremely tall girl friendly. I'm short, so they are dragging the ground. And I just have one of my um, little coach sandals slide situations because they are comfy and they have like almost like a memory foam inside. 
the um shoe sandal. So that's all I'm wearing today. Hey, somebody blowing the horn. I don't know if they was unlocking their car, or blowing the horn, but hey. Um, so yeah, that's what's going on today. I have talked for five minutes and twenty some seconds. Way too long. So I'm gonna end this talking here and I'll see y'all in whatever store I end up in first. I think I'm gonna go to Michael's first because I'll get to Michael's before I get to the other stores. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Michael's, then I'll go to, wait, do I wanna go to Michael's first? Actually, no, I'm gonna go to Michael's last because the stuff I have to get from the grocery store is nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Michael's first. This road is rough. Anyway, I done talked enough. I'll talk to y'all soon. I'm at Michael's, y'all, and they have these um, smaller pumpkins. They have orange, black, and white for $4.99. And they have some larger ones for $15 or $14.99, just orange and white. You can actually carve these also. You could use these as decoration. You can paint them, you can decorate them, you can sparkle them up, jizz them up, whatever. You can do that with the small ones too. So let's go inside and see what they have. All right, so, oh, they have a nice cornucopia. My mom wants a cornucopia. So this one is 30, same size. And these are some of their flowers. Okay, so these are on sale. So what did I just say? It's 30, so right now it's 15. And they have all these flower stems. Uh, let's see how much the flower stems are. Whoops, look at me making a mess in these people's store. All right, so this one is 10. So it's gonna be five right there. And I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna assume that the larger ones cost more. Let's see. No, that was 10 also. Let's see how much the sunflowers are. Yeah, they're all 10. So all the flower stems are 10. And they are right now on sale for five. Oh, I love these pumpkins here. These are soft. I like these. These are 20. And that would mean that they're on sale for 10. They have some cute little baskets too. I need a basket for the den. Oh, I could use this though. Cause I want something to roll blankets up and put blankets by the fireplace. So that's 30, so that's gonna be 15, I think. Yeah, so, all right, now let's go in and see. Oh, look at these nice signs. These are nice. The welcome sign. These are 50% off. And it says welcome. It says welcome. And let's see. Oh, I love that. Look at that. It's got a little stand on the back. And it is 30. And it's 50% off. So that's not bad. That's 15. And then they have the pumpkins also. Y'all hold on one second, because I might need to call my mom and see if she wants me to get her one of these. But that's cute, I like those. So inside they have some fuchsia pumpkins, and then the traditional white, orange, and black. So these are nice. And then down there, they have more flower sprays. Are they called a flower spray? Oh, these are actually little bouquets. For 10. That's pretty. I love the colors. These are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, they have some Thanksgiving towels out. Gobble till you wobble, that's cute. And it's um, two towels. I'm not crazy about the second one, but I do like the first one. It's kind of cute, but I'm not too crazy about the pattern on that one. Or maybe it's the colors. I don't know. It's kind of dated to me. That one's cute too. Keep your eyes on the pies. Got your turkey baster and brush. So they have some cute things out. And I think 
They have some molds, maybe. Oh, your t uh, Thanksgiving table decorations and place settings. Cute little things. And then this is cute some for tailgating for football season. Look at this wreath. Huh. It's interesting. I don't. Hmm. I think this is a bit high, in my opinion. That's a little too much for that wreath. Whoa. Girl, I had the car in reverse. Or when I was growing up, I used to say I had the car in backup. <laughs> um, but anyway, they do have a really good 60% off sale um, on quite a bit of their fall um, stuff. Uh, they have little flower vases that have like fl flowers, sprays of flowers in it, which is what exa exactly what I was telling my mom that I wanted to do for the two end tables that they have. Put like two little, a vase on each table with a few flowers in it and put like a pumpkin in front of it or um, what in the world was that that just flew over my car? Or um, take a garland and cut it to make like a little spray of leaves in front just to give it that fall festive feeling. And then um, on the, the big table, I don't know. I don't know if I would put anything on there because they use that for like their books and things like that. Or I could put like a pumpkin in the center um, or a smaller cornucopia. But they do have items that are what I need to start with in Michael's. Um, still gonna go in, go in um, Home Goods and see what they have. I should go to Pop Shelf, but when I, when I went in there last, they didn't have many fall things because they'd already sold out of a lot of their stuff. So I, I don't know. I'll, girl, my phone fell. Y'all ladies tell me I was dropping y'all on the floor. I need a new phone mount and I need a camera mount. And how about I came out the house, charged my batteries, and came out of the house without an extra battery. So I don't even know how much time I have left on this battery. Not long. So I'm not going to be using the camera much. But I do need a, a mount for my camera um, so that I can have it in the car instead of just using it when I get out of the car. Um because y'all know I have an older car and I like to play music from my phone. And when I'm recording, I can't play music from my phone when I'm, because it's just gonna, it's gonna do one thing. It ain't gonna do two, it's gonna do one. So I can record from my camera and play, still play my music from my phone or play a podcast while I'm driving if I'm recording and talking to y'all or whatever. But that's, that's two things I need to do. I need to get a new phone mount and I need to get a camera mount. Um, oh my gosh, they had this, um, casserole dish for five bucks ceramic and they had a loaf pan but I don't need them but I wanted them they were only five dollars and I'm thinking I should have probably got them I mean I always could use extra stuff in the kitchen right y'all help me justify it so I can go back <laughs> never mind don't help me with bad habits mm -mm. I'm going to the store I'm gonna look for this stuff for my mother and then I'm going to the grocery store and pick up what I need. And I need, oh, I, while I'm out, I gotta get some skincare. So I'm gonna go to Marshall's. All right, so now I'm in Michael's, I mean, at home store. And I was gonna, I was thinking home goods, but I meant at home. So these are some of the jaco lanterns that they have. Some of them light up, some of them can be carved. And this one, uh, I don't like that. But they have this big one here. And then they have um, all kinds of fall like blankets and this is where i got my blankets from i like the little pumpkin one mm, fall throws this is what this one looks like and i like it because they have the pictures so that you can see exactly what the pattern of the throw is this one is pretty that's pretty so they have several different patterns i wouldn't get this one because i'm not too keen on them raccoons and stuff like that but this one is pretty oh this one matches my my um blue 
stuff on my chair. Okay, so that's that. And they have candles. Girl, these is Christmas. These Christmas candles right here. So they have Christmas stuff out already. And but I'm just looking for fall stuff. Um, this is a kitchen mat. It's a kitchen mat. I was looking more so for fall mats for the front porch for my mom. But this one is nice as a kitchen mat. And then that one. This one reminds me of the Hallmark movies. My favorite section, pillows. Y'all know I love the Oh, look at this. So soft and plush. <gasps> I love this. Of course, it doesn't match any of the pillows I have. How much is it? Oh, stickers on here. 10 bucks. That's not bad. I like this one too. These are nice. If you like the more natural colors. But I like to go for a little bit more color. There's another front porch little decoration. Another welcome sign. I'm not into gnomes that much. But I know some people are. Like that pumpkin. Halloween. This is pretty. Now this one I could do, even though it's that more natural color. I do like the beading and I love the colors of the pumpkins. I, oh, this is a cornucopia. I really like that. Yeah, I just absolutely love to decorate for the seasons and holidays and stuff. That's cute. This is welcome fall. Again, those the truck ones always remind me of the um, Hallmark movies. Oh, this is a pretty wreath. That is so pretty. Oh, it's falling apart though. That's not good. These are some nice front porch doormats. They're for like a larger porch. Or you can put it like in front of your steps as you go into the house too. And gather and thanks and giving. I mean, I could use these for fall. I think that this is something that can translate from fall to all the way through Christmas. What y'all think? All right, so these are all of the little... um vessels you can use for like making your flower arrangements or, or you can just sit them around I'm just looking for like um, some nice maybe amber and green for my mom and my dad's house I do like this one I like this one a lot although it's kind of big I think I do need to stick with a small size like this and it is green it's but i don't know if you can tell but it is it has a hue of green to it but i want to do something like this with flowers in it for them and i like this one too i like this one also oh look these are cute that's cute hmm. 249 that's not bad so I could do something like that. And they don't have to match. Because I'm not a matchy matchy person. But I like that one too. Two, two forty nine. Let's see. Yeah, I think I want to stick with something that size for their table. Um No, I don't want they want to go with blue. Yeah, I like those down there. Those are nice. Oh, look at this. I love this. I could actually sit a, a battery operated candle in there and sit that on the floor by the fireplace. I like that. Hmm. So many things to choose from. Oh, this is gorgeous. It's so pretty. I like this one too. This 
is a different type of basket. I am so tempted to go over to the Christmas section, but that is not why I'm here today. My focus is fall stuff. Although I'm very tempted to go over there. I'm not gonna do it, I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna stick with looking at fall stuff and thanks. I'm not even going to the Thanksgiving stuff. I'm gonna stick with fall stuff. This one is nice, but it will be a little too wide for the flowers like I wanna do for their table. But I do like this. I can use this in like the bathroom for like a toothbrush holder. Mm -hmm. And if you're not a traditional color, like the traditional orange, although this is pretty, you have different color pumpkins, different fabrics, all different kinds. These are so pretty. Oh gosh, this is absolutely beautiful. It matches the blues that I have in my den. So I do like that. Okay, I just saw some stuff that's on clearance over here. Let's see if any of this can be used. No, those are too big. But here's some things that there are on clearance just in case you see something that you like or that you have been looking for. Anybody having a wedding? Bouquet already made up for you. And it's 18 bucks. And you could keep it and not have to worry about tossing. Or you could use that as a toss bouquet for your wedding too. You can use that as your bouquet or you can use it as a toss bouquet. And you can keep your own flowers and dry them and keep them. All right, let's get out of this store and get to the grocery store. I cannot wait to go back to at home um, when it's time for me to start getting Christmas stuff, meaning next month, because it's October. I like to try to get Christmas decor early. I let a gnat in when I got in the car. Um, I like to get Christmas decorations as early as possible. October is early enough for me. So I'll be back next month to pick up some Christmas decor. I really wanted to go down there. Y'all do not know how bad I wanted to go down that side of the store, but I refrained. So now I'm gonna go to, um, what's this store? Kroger and pick up the things that I need to use for dinner tonight or today, cause I'm gonna start cooking. I gotta vacuum my car out. So I'm gonna vacuum my car out then I'm gonna get in the kitchen and um start cooking dinner i should have parked down there yeah 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 oh they have their mums out oh they got pumpkins two for eleven but i'm going to the pumpkin patch and pick pumpkins i need to make sure oh i still gotta stop by marshall's because i need some skincare i was getting ready to say i need to um, I'm going to pick pumpkins at the it's a lot of people in this store It's a lot of people in this store like parking lots full Do I feel like going in Kroger I really want to go in Kroger But this parking lot is so darn full right now Maybe by the time I go in, get my groceries, um, the lines won't be super long. Because I'm parked all the way at the end. Why well, I feel like I'm not in the parking spot right. I am. Okay, so look y'all. I think I'm gonna try these. I just saw a commercial about these melts. So I'm gonna try these and I 
to see how they actually work. I was looking to see if they actually had my um, cleanser on sale in here. That way I won't have to stop at um, Marshall's. But I might just do that anyway. Because Marshall Marshall's, I can get 20% off this weekend. Um, I'm thinking about trying these though. Nothing beats a failure, but a try. <laughs> so I'm, I'm gonna, I am gonna try these. So I'm trying the new Pecan Perfection um, drinks that they have here at Starbucks. I am getting a Pecan Crunch, iced Pecan Crunch oat milk latte. And she said it wasn't super sweet, so fingers crossed that it's not, because y'all know I don't like really sweet, sweet coffee, but I'm excited to try it because I love pecans, or some people call it pecans, but I'm excited to try it. Okay, it is really, really good. Not sweet at all. It has that, it's like smoky, nutty, creamy, with like a hint of sugar. So it's really good. And the lines are still long. All right, y'all. So I'm not going to Marshall's. One, because I don't feel like it. <laughs> and two, because I did manage to find, um, two cleansers that I like and they're by Olay. I really wanted to get my e.l.f., but they didn't have the e.l.f. cleanser that I like. They had the the whole hydration kit except for the cleanser. And I want the e.l.f. Um, holy hydration cleanser. So from Marshall's, I was just going to try a new skincare and like maybe some new um, facial creams, but do I really need it? No. I do need a moisturizer, but I always get that from CVS with my um, points because I have points and I have a $10. Um, I signed up for the CVS. I don't even know what it's called, but it's, it's some kind of rewards program. You kind of pay for it because it's $10 a month. No, it's $5 a month and you get $10 a month to spend. So I have $10 right now. Plus I have a $3 off a, a entire purchase a two dollar off an entire purchase and i think it's some percentage of off of some products by olay or no it's by revlon so i don't know i'm gonna just use that when i go to get my moisturizer and stuff i'm not gonna spend unnecessary money at marshall's although i could get 20 percent off this weekend i'm gonna do good and not spend where i don't need to spend i didn't get the yams and i didn't get the um um, green beans and I didn't get any smoked turkey from Kroger because they were restocking and they are like their produce is basically none right now of what I need so I still need to go to Food Lion by the house and get those three items and um, I have chicken bouillon already so I'm gonna do the green beans I'm gonna do the fried cabbage I do I want to put some peppers in my cabbage so I do need to get some um, red yellow red and yellow cat i mean red and orange bell peppers to go in my cat <clears throat> excuse me my cabbage okay i just had to fix my phone thing. i was like why is my phone looking so crazy like the view girl is that let me get out of this car it's about to rain what i was saying was the phone looked odd like my view I still don't really like it, but the phone is higher and I do like the height that it is at. But my, I had, I forgot I adjusted the um, phone mount and it was really low. So this is better. I don't even know why I told y'all that. That was some, some random Tanya stuff. So ta-da, there it is. I'm gonna run in this grocery store real quick though. But um, on a good note, I just got gas for $2.67. How did I do that? Because I have the 7-Eleven app and I always go to lock price and that chooses the lowest gas price in the area for 7-Eleven and then you get a discount off of that. So the lowest price in this area yesterday was when I locked it, it showed 273. So when I got to the pump, I hit, you know, pay for fuel and then it gave me my my little because I have the rewards app, gave me my little percentage off so I ended up paying 267 a gallon. I call that winning at the pump.
there Cause everything reminds me of you I can't take no more Girl, I think I'm losing my mind Try to go to work, but I lost track of time Cause everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Okay, y'all. I hope you have enjoyed hanging with me today. Um, waiting for my lobster tails to finish cooking. Waiting for the chicken to finish cooking. But it is late and I am tired. So I'm going to end the video here. And I'll probably do a video or show you at the end what the food looks like once it's all done. But I'm going to bid you adieu and just say goodnight. Hope you've enjoyed hanging with me today. And I will talk to you all next time. Bye. Can we stop the clock and rewind? Go back to that moment in time. When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie?